going on guys may 2nd 2019 should be a good day I'm gonna get some work in here this morning then i'm gonna go see my boy gary v tonight in austin uh so super looking forward to that and uh if you guys are going to the show tonight hit me up i got for you know. guys dad just listened to an awesome interview with sean white and he talked about how the way he won so many of those gold medals in the olympics and the x games while he was snowboarding and uh, skateboarding was he was doing things that separated himself from the past. He wasn't the best rider on the mountain. He would do that one trick, that one separating trick that made him elevated in the, in the eyes of the judges above everyone else. So he said, what can you do if you're going on a sales call, if you're trying to get a promotion, if you're what's the one thing you can do to separate yourself from the pack, make you look different than everybody else, catch the eyes of whoever you're trying to get in front of and, and get your way to success through being the one thing, uh, the one person that separates themselves from the one thing, that one extra thing, that one little thing. So what can you do today to separate yourself from the pack by doing something a little extra, a little more, a little different? That's what I got. To separate yourself from your competition. Walking the dog here. Had a pretty decent day in the office. A few good sales came in. On the way to Austin shortly. What's going on Facebook? Taylor Abbott here, Alpha Graphics West Ave in the Dirty Kitchen. Hope you guys are doing super fantastic today. I'm on my way to see one of my big time uh, business mentors, Gary Vaynerchuk. He's going to be speaking live in Austin tonight at the Paramount Theater. So I'm heading over there uh, right now. Uh, on the way there so I thought I'd shoot a quick little video for the vlog if you're not watching that you can find it over on YouTube just search the dirty kitchen and you'll find that pop up there uh, but what am I expecting to get out of tonight's event is what I wanted to do a quick little video about here and I'll be honest with you I'm not entirely sure what to expect so it's being put on by a guy named Aubrey Marcus who I've done a little bit of uh, research on here prior to the event and he had a few of some interesting views, maybe I wouldn't necessarily agree with, does some interesting stuff that I don't know about either. It's nothing that's worked for me, uh, but, so that's the one thing that's kind of interesting, but at the same time, Gary V does all of this stuff that uh, kind of has guided me throughout the social media landscape, the social media marketing, and how to use Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat uh, to your advantage in order to get yourself branded personally as well as business wise so that's why I'm doing things like this video right here so he's had a super big impact on me he's just up the road in Austin and I figured man I better go check this out while I have the opportunity so that's what I'm doing right now on the way there as we speak uh, and this this event itself is called design your life and I know Gary the one thing that I don't necessarily love that Gary talks about is that he says you'd rather have happiness than uh, money and I know I of course always you want to be happy and it's not all about the money but at the same time you can be happy and have money so I'd rather do that instead of just all being all about just being happy and doing what I love I don't mind working a little hard getting a little dirty getting a little nasty to get a few extra dollars in the bank so I'm not sure if that's what the whole night's gonna be about or not I guess we'll find out so living downtown you always have to deal with a whole bunch of terrible drivers they're always slow don't know what they're doing getting in their way taking wrong turns I'm in downtown Austin today, and I'm one of those you deal with by. every day. Taking wrong turns, don't know where I'm going, trying to look at the phone, stuff right. What do you know? Okay, we made it. The only thing I can say is that whoever did the printing of the background could have done way better. They should have called Alpha Graphics. Not bad, but really? Gary V. Look at the separation on that thing, man. Come on. Come on, man. Call AG West Ave next time you need something. It's like, how are you doing? Life is good. I'm happy. That's what I fucking love about seeing you, man. I appreciate it. Yeah. Because that's, <coughs> that's that immediate, immediate frame of reference of like, oh, that perspective is right. <coughs> yeah, I mean, I, you know, obviously I was catching parts of 
what you were saying, and I think the reality is, I, I very much do believe that you find what you're looking for. You know, I grew up in a household where I had probably extremities on both sides. You know, I had certain family members who were just disproportionately negative. And like, regardless of, like when something good happened, it was hedged immediately with like, that's a fucking conspiracy. You know, like, like just like enormous like negativity. And then my mom, thank God, because it was the primary person I spent my first, you know, 14 years with every day, was so disproportionately positive. And so, you know, I lived a life where it's very obvious to me that you can have a very different perspective on the same situation because I had two very big, different reactions growing up to a lot of things. And um, I just wish that, you know, it's very easy to find negativity if you're looking for it right now, but it's equally easy to find positivity. Nobody's talking about it. I started that. asking if this world of form is merely the illusion of attachment. If I could let it all go, my roof would be the stars. My floor would be the earth. My doors would be a job. My walls would be the wind. My seat would be a stone. My bed would be the clouds, and my heart would be my home. But since I have a family, and I don't live this life alone, I'm gonna buy a house where I can make memories in every room. 